Welcome everyone, it's my daily vlog channel, Eric B's Daily Vlogs. Weather is warm, overcast, and I think it's gonna rain. At least, that's what the forecast says. Rain in April, wow. I don't remember the last time it rained in April, but they said it's gonna rain. Man, oh man, United Airlines, you guys are in trouble. If you haven't seen the video, here it is. Pilots drive to Louisville? Can't they rent a car for the pilots and have them drive? Ah! No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! No! Guys, my god! What are you doing? No, this is wrong! Oh my god! Look at what you did to him! Oh my god! Can't the pilots drive to Can't they run a car with the pilots and get them to drive? Hey! 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 Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! There you go. Hey! Busted his lip. Oh my God! Look at what you did to him! Good work. Way to go. This is horrible. Just kill me. Just kill me. Kill me. Just kill me. You had to go home. Kill me. Just kill me. Just kill me. Just kill me. I have to go home. I have to go home. I have to go home. But yes. Terrible, right? Terrible. What are you guys doing? Forcing a guy off the seat when he already said no, he doesn't want to do it. And just because they needed four employees to make it to the next stop, they, they forced someone. To me, it doesn't matter how many times the CEO and United apologizes. I mean, you see that video, it's, it's, it, you're taking away what our civil rights are when it comes to something like that. I mean, it's like, it's, it's like you're telling someone that they can't sit in a plane or sit in a seat that they already paid for. And what makes it worse was the guy says he was a doctor. He hasn't come forward yet. Um, so we don't know. We don't know if he was a doctor or not. He said he had patients he had to see the next morning. That's the reason why he didn't want to get off the flight. But then to forcefully get someone off the plane, physically get them off the plane. I mean, you see the picture, his face is bloody. His lip was bleeding. I mean, that's just uncalled for. Come on, United. And, and I mean, it's like just, it's disturbing to watch. So you had four employees that needed to get to Kentucky. So you needed to make room for four. So they already offered vouchers, hotel, all that. Three of them accepted it. The one who didn't accept it was like, all right, well, we're gonna randomly pick someone. And they picked one guy who didn't wanna do it. And again, they, I don't even wanna say forcefully, they violently removed him from his seat, which if someone did that to me, man, I don't care, security guard or not, that is not called for, that is so unnecessary. So Dr. David Dow, they finally released his name, he's an internal medical doctor from Louisville. So, he was a real doctor, even though he said he was a real doctor. Now, what they did to him was wrong. I mean, he's an internal medicine doctor in Kentucky, Louisville. He was on his way to Kentucky, and he even told them, I'm a doctor and I have patients to see in the morning. Come on, what more do you have to tell a person? Now you have a lot of Asian Americans or Asian community who's crying foul saying that they picked him because he was Asian and if he was non-Asian that they probably wouldn't have picked him or if he was non-Asian and they said he was a doctor they probably would have gone to the next person and I mean bottom line is if someone says no you don't forcefully kick him out or do that and it's not even forcefully it was violent you see the poor man's lips were bleeding. History has a family of doctors. His wife's a doctor. His kids are doctors as well. 
in the state of Illinois. And like again, they violated his rights by doing what they did to him. And, and United Airlines, you're definitely gonna pay. Don't be surprised if you see the owner of United Airlines is gonna be Dr. David Dow. Um, it's just terrible, terrible that this is, this is what America has become, this is what we have to live with when it comes to this type of violence. I mean, it's just not called for. 69 years old, he's considered elderly in a lot of communities. 69 years old, and this is what they did to an elderly man. A doctor, 69 year old doctor, and this is what they did to him. And if you watch the video, right before he was just sitting there minding his own business not doing anything and for them to just sit there and pull him out violently physically then you know that's definitely not what you want done and the fact that again they busted his lip they dragged him i mean to me that violated a lot of civil rights a lot of a lot of human human rights as well. You just don't do that. You don't do that to a person. You don't you don't do that. He's a doctor. He's an elderly doctor. You just don't do that. So United Airlines, shame on you for doing that. Shame on you for having your guys do that. And I'm hoping that this is not the society that we're going to end up living in. I'm hoping that this is a one-time deal, one-time act with United Airlines. United Airlines already has a bad reputation as it is and they just made their reputation even worse. So I'm hoping it's just this one time, I hope these guys get punished, what, you know, they get punished. They're supposed to get punished and however the punishment may be, I hope they get it. I hope it's definitely a good punishment for them. Um, and it's definitely something that we can't live with. This is not the society that I wanna live in where you have guys being taken out from an airline seat. You have guys being stereotype from an airline seat. This is not the society we want to live in. And United Airlines, shame on you. And CEO for apologizing three times. First one was a bogus. Second one was even worse. The third one, it was just, it's, it was bull crap. So hopefully you get your stuff together and hopefully, you know, justice will come to those guys who did this. All right guys, nice vlog about United Airlines and how much they suck and we'll definitely never fly United again either so we're gonna fly another Airlines when it comes time to it definitely not United. Alright guys vlog is ended. Go in peace.